Well, I'm Kenny Lowry. Today we're going to take a look at the Shimmering Walk uh, Patio Deck Fountain. Now, this is a very large walk bar bowl. Uh, this is as large as they come, and this is as large a patio setup that we have for it, too. And it does work on here as long as you don't have too much water flowing in here. So this is about the right amount of flume uh, for this particular setup. If you have any more than that, or if you get it off level, then the water might drop off this rim outside of your base. So you don't want that to happen. So if you want the water to kind of gently flow over, follow the base down, because the base is slightly bigger or right at the same size as your reservoir down here. So this is a really great looking fountain. I think it's a great looking setup. It has the uh, custom finish that we put on it, so it's kind of got a shimmering effect. We're partially in the shade here, so I don't know if you're going to be able to see that part of it, but it does have a shimmering effect when the sun hits down on it. I'll get close with the camera and show you up close. Kind of nice gentle sound to it. It's not intended to be like a gushing fountain. I think it's going to patio or deck. You have to be careful. You can get too loud uh, on a patio or deck. Now, I understand sometimes people wanting to mask uh, sounds, and those are things we can work on. Uh, this could be, uh, without increasing the flow of the water, we can increase the plume uh, without actually increasing the flow. What you do is restricting that plume of water uh, giving a little more pressure. You have to just make sure that you're at that spot where it doesn't flow outside of that. Right now, I'll grab the camera and show you up close. Hopefully, you'll be able to see that shimmering effect off of this mountain. This custom finish is just beautiful that we do on it. And we do uh, offer this in limited because it does take us a, a while to do this finish. I think you can kind of see that shimmering. Because it's a reflective finish on there, you get that shimmering effect. Of course, with all our fountains, we recommend if you let us put a light in there for you, uh, the lighting is really uh, spectacular. Uh, it's a must on all fountains, really. Uh, this is attractive all the way around. I'll see if I can get around here to the shady side. You can see the pump is just right down there in that corner. Now, if you want, we have made these so that the pump could, cord could run out the bottom on the inside. Um, I think it's better to have the pump accessible, easily accessible, although it could go up under that base right there if that's something you want. But if you get any debris in there and you need to clean that intake, you're going to want to be able to access that pump relatively easy. As always, if you have any questions, you can reach me at 540-948-2239 or email me, Kenny, at southerngraceva.com.